Gabi Klaff, and I wanted to share with you what I realized tonight um, as I'm putting my kids to bed. Um, first of all, I'll show you my adorable children. They are busy um, in a kind of productive mode, but very calm and quiet. Um, Danya is coloring and writing in her journal. Sola is coloring. And, ah, this one's fallen asleep with a carrot. He's cuddling with a carrot. Um, and what I wanted to share with you is that we are in Taganga, Colombia. I'm on my hammock. Um, and though we're traveling the world and we have lots of time with our kids, suddenly I felt like, wow, I don't feel like I've talked to them. Uh, lately, just sort of talked and, and saw what they're going through, what they feel. So they were in their beds, sort of calming down for the evening, and I thought this is a great time to use a tool that I strongly encourage parents to use called the interview. Just get next to your kid and start asking him, what's your favorite color? You know, what songs do you like? What's up? Um, how, what, uh, how's this going? How's that going? Interviewing our kids and getting to know them. So I get on the bed and I start interviewing them and I realize that I'm totally bothering my children. Um, they're into their own thing. They're busy in their own frequency. They're enjoying this quiet time with themselves. And then suddenly the interrogator comes and I realize that they weren't excited with the attention or the interest I was showing them that I was actually bothering them. Um, so it was really good for me to realize that, hey, this tool doesn't work when someone is engrossed in, a, in an activity that requires concentration and they're enjoying themselves. Um, so I just said, Gabi, be quiet. Be quiet and just enjoy them, observe them. Don't make this a precious moment. Don't manufacture something that's meaningful. Just be with them um, with no agenda. And uh, as I lay there, then suddenly Awazi started telling me about the soldiers and their roles and how they're engaging in war and how they're using lighting um, and music sort of within that storyline. And I didn't have to ask really interested questions or reflect or anything. I just had to be there and listen. Um, and then the girls started showing me their works of art um, and just sharing with me that you know they're trying this style and this and that. And it was just beautiful for me again to realize that I didn't have to create anything actively, that the best thing I could do to bond with my kids this evening was to be passive and observe. So good night to you and um, thanks for listening.